Lake Atitlan, Guatemala, is surrounded by volcanoes and small villages. The lake is approximately 1,000 feet deep. San Juan, La Laguna, is famous for its hand-woven textiles made of cotton. The Mayan weavers in San Juan, La Laguna, grow their own cotton to use on their hand-woven textiles. After the cotton is cleaned, it is softened by pounding it for 30 minutes. The threading process begins. The cotton is stretched out on a hand spindle. If the cotton separates, no need to tie a knot. The thread is united by continuing to turn the spindle and stretching the cotton. This technique is taught to the female child at age seven. The beet is used to make the color red and the carrot gives the color orange. Various natural plants and bugs are used to make the color dyes. The plants are cooked for at least three hours. Today, Dora cooked the plant called chirka. It was cooked in a clay pot. By soaking the cotton in the dye of the cooked plant, the desired color is obtained. The longer the cotton is soaked in the dye, the darker the color. Less time, the lighter the color. Once you have the desired color, the next process is to color fast the cotton thread in the banana trunk. This stops the dyeing process, so it won't fade, it won't rub off, and it won't stain. As you can see, the dye does not rub off. The dark color comes from the seed, the chayote plant. And then on the other side, the threads are dyed orange from the carrots. All of the hand-woven textiles are valuable works of art from this weaving co-op in San Juan, La Laguna.